Jamie. Good Hi, morning. Jules. What? Hi, Jules. What is all this? You going on well, vacation? Well, yeah, right. Actually, it's not really a vacation. I have to go and see the colorectal surgeon. Ooh. I know. Ooh. Well, last year I had some health challenges and my, my colon and my bowels needed surgeons and some help and it was really scary. And I'm going down to meet with the doctor again today. It's my six month review and we're gonna set up some things for another set of testing to see how I'm doing. And I want, and I'm calling forth from the divine part of me that knows how to heal, I'm calling forth an A plus report card. So today I'm going to go meet with Dr. Kim and just talk to him and we'll set up the next testing procedures to see how I'm doing. So this is definitely a call for joy in the mundane. A eh, mundane buddy? A. A. So here we go. Hope everything so, comes out all right. So, yeah, thank you, Joe. Yeah. I'm looking forward to that. I've been releasing so much in my life that that is just stuck history and stuff that doesn't come forward and in life. You know, it's all symbolic, right? Yes. So here we go to yeah. find joy in the mundane. We've packed a really awesome lunch. You helped me make it. It's, oh, I'm excited about it. And because a healthy lunch is fabulous, the treat bag is even <laughs> more important. Oh my God, oh, there's good. great treats. I have no that. idea what's in there. That's what, and, that looks good. Here's my big supercharged green drink, raw foods, and my cup of tea. So cheers to our departure. Let's go. Let's go mundane, buddy. Let's Everybody listening, follow along with us as we find joy in the mundane and something most people wouldn't find fun. We're going to do it. Join us. Hi, Joel. You made it, Jamie. Here I am, Arizona Oncology. I'm here for my appointment. Oh, I'm going to need some joy in this mundane moment because Dr. Kim is going to take a really skinny little big flashlight and have an exam. So I shouldn't be laughing at that. I know. But it's, it's so good you brought I'm going to bring some here. joy into this moment because I don't know how else to do it. Yeah. I know. Hold on, him. So I'm going to go in for my appointment now, and we'll see you later. Okay. Thanks. Bye. Ow. Ow! Don't get hurt. There you are. Hi, Joel. Hi, Joel. Hi, Joel. Well, that was fast. And you know what? He didn't use the flashlight. Oh. I know. <laughs> kind of disappointed. No. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. But I was ready. I had my sock monkey. No, actually, what he did, he decided not to do that because we've scheduled a follow-up exam, which is a partial colonoscopy, coming up in the next few weeks. And I just found out, you know what? It's colorectal cancer awareness month. And what month is it? March. Yeah. So this is my birthday present to myself this month is to just be aware, preventable, treatable, and beatable. Anyway, sometime soon I'm actually going to interview Dr. Kim and have a little five minute segment about the importance of following through with those colonoscopies. I would have never done it if it wasn't for the fact I was leaving my job and afraid I'd be without insurance for a while, so I was doing all the free things I could. Thank God. Yeah. Because my life depended on it. Good. Anyway, let's go on and have a little picnic, Joel. Lovely. Bye, everybody. Mm -hmm. Hi, Joel. I'm recording myself. Not only am I at Macy's, there's a Starbucks in here too, and a mall. So I'm going to get my Starbucks and I'm heading for the shoes. Sweet. <laughs> 